On December 6th, President Trump's words shook the world. He recognized Jerusalem as the capital of Israel, and whether he knows it or not, fulfilled his part in a frightening biblical prophecy. Because according to the final chapters of the Bible, our country and every American citizen are about to face its greatest tribulation. Only the church leaders know the true meaning of this biblical prophecy that is encrypted in the writings of four ancient prophets, inspired to send a warning across the centuries to all true Christians and patriots. Therefore, before watching this documentary, be forewarned. You are about to see how all the world's leaders and their armies are silently playing their part in the lead up to the greatest and darkest event in human history. An event that may leave 290 million Americans dead in its wake. Once you witness the chilling evidence of the words of our Lord coming true, there is no turning back. It will simply be impossible for you to go about your daily life like you used to before knowing the truth. But take comfort, for it is God's will that you are here now so that you may have the time to prepare and maybe grant you salvation from all the wickedness of our times. And if you're feeling skeptical right now, let me ask you one question. Who would have thought 70 years ago that the Jewish people would have a country to call their own? Only those who read Ezekiel chapter 37. That is what the prophet wrote 2,700 years ago. The hand of the Lord was on me and set me in the middle of a valley it was full of bones. Then he said to me, These bones are the people of Israel, my people. I will take the Israelites out of the nations where they have gone. I will gather them from all around and bring them back into their own land. I will make them one nation in the land on the mountains of Israel. Word by word, the prophecy made by Ezekiel came true. In 1947, the nation of Israel was born after the horror of the Holocaust, symbolized by the Valley of Bones. Scattered for more than 2,000 years, the Jewish people come from all over the world into this new state and made it an economic and military power. Yet, it was not whole. Israel needed Jerusalem to become its rightful capital again, and that only happened with the support of President Trump. However, to the north of Israel, other biblical prophecies have come true. The prophets Isaiah and Jeremiah write about this Syrian civil war. This is what the prophet Isaiah says, Damascus will no longer be a city, but will become a heap of ruins. And these are the words of Jeremiah. Damascus has become feeble. She has turned to flee and panic has gripped her. Anguish and pain have seized her. Surely her young men will fall in the streets. For 5,000 years, the capital city of Syria stood as one of the oldest and most prosperous cities in the world. But the civil war began in 2011 and turned it into a ruin. Not only do the prophets talk about the war, but also the refugee crisis and the deaths of its men fighting for one side or the other. The army of Syrian dictator Bashar al-Assad has been fighting the rebels backed by the United States, Israel, Turkey, Jordan, and Saudi Arabia.